This video is presented by Quick Maths. Today's topic: Days of the Months. Today's aim: to find out the number of days in a month without a calendar. For example, finding the number of days in November without a calendar and by using our fist. We'll be using both our knuckles and our grooves. Notice there are four knuckles and three grooves. Let's learn by example. Example one: How many days are there in November? Take out your left fist. The first knuckle nearest to your thumb is January. The first groove nearest to your thumb is February. Like so, count the months following: March, April, May, June, July. Once you've reached July, start counting the months again from the knuckle nearest to your thumb. August, then September, October, November, and December. Now we know what the knuckles and the fist mean in months. Notice that the knuckle months are red and the groove months are blue. The knuckle months have thirty-one days and the groove months have thirty days. February is an exception; it either has twenty-eight or twenty-nine days. November is a groove month, so it has thirty days. Here is our final answer for example one: How many days are there in November? Thirty days. Example two: How many days are there in March? Let's use our fist technique and start counting until March, January, February, and March. The final answer for example two is how many days are there in March? Since March was a knuckle month, thirty-one days. Summary: Step one: Use your fist to count the months. Step two: Knuckles have thirty-one days and grooves have thirty days. We have some practice questions for you to have a go. Pause the video. Take out your fist and solve these questions. We have answers for these practice questions below. Be sure to like this video, share it with your classmates, and subscribe to Quick Maths.